Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a store walkthrough or store walkthroughs from a couple different days. Uh, this clip is from July 1st, Saturday, and we are at the Roseville Galleria. Just kidding, we are at Creekside Center in Roseville, and I'm checking out the leftover white barn candles that they have. Strawberry pound cake is still going pretty strong, and black tremolo, there's only one left on that shelving unit and here we have some of the fall candles autumn woods in that frosty green jar i took a little sniff there and pumpkin cinnamon bun that one's always nice i actually like that packaging apple macchiato that one is pretty good as well i'm not sure if i'll get any of these because i have plenty of fall candles left cranberry woods uh this side is okay but i mostly like the purple jar there and we have uh what is that brewed coffee freshly brewed co i totally missed it but the coffee one and leaves in that kind of amber colored glass jar with the other candles in that collection i believe my favorite candle in this collection is pumpkin apple i like the deep red uh glass jar cinnamon spice vanilla and sweater weather and for this collection, I think my favorite candle would be Honeycrisp Apple. Yep, this one. I think that one, that that packaging is gorgeous. I love the pink, and it has almost a marble effect to it, which I think looks really, really cool. And I'm taking a little glance at the wallflowers, but I don't use them, so I really need to spend a little more time with them. Raspberry Mimosa, just because... Um, People in the audience definitely you do use them. Fresh fall morning, pumpkin bonfire. Pumpkin bonfire is a lovely smoky scent. I do like that one. And yeah, I should probably <laughs> pick some of those wallflowers up so we can see them better. Uh, candles on the wall. Now, these used to be all of the 75% off white barn candles. Now, it's all fall candles. I'm not even sure what the collection, what the name of this collection is. Is it like fall drinks? Is that what I saw? I'm not sure, but here are the white barn candles. Uh, yes, white, the pumpkin apple is my favorite, and I'm pretty sure I'll get that one, even though I have many pumpkin apple candles already. Here is the white barn 75% off candles that are in the back of the store. So you can see strawberry pound cake. Oh, there's one black cherry merlot again, um, just like the other section. Just one left. This one was pretty much all 99.9 percent .9 strawberry pound cake these are the last ones in the store so when these are gone um say goodbye to the 75 percent off white barn candles and here are some of the new soaps i'm not sure if i'll get any of these because sass is a great time to buy soaps and i definitely did i probably purchased 30 so therefore none of these really appeal to me mojave plum that one actually did appeal to me, but it, I guess it turns out to be a repackage of Wild Berry Plum or something like that, which I already have. I thought this, I think this is called Do Dogwood? Dogwood soap holder is really nice. It's really sparkly in here. So I'm just making the mushroom wiggle around there, and there it is with a pocket back in it. I love that it's winking. And some of the more of the fall soaps, raspberry green tea. Uh, pumpkin pecan waffles and pumpkin apple. I think pumpkin apple is my favorite in that soap collection. And we are still at Creekside, and I wanted to take a look at what blends candles they have left. Yeah, marshmallow fireside and black cherry merlot. Still tons of those. Uh, I, did they make just tons of that candle, or is that one just a hard pass for everyone? But I have it. It's pretty light though. And one more section of 75% off white barn candles. And we have a few more black cherry merlots there. I'm pretty sure the two we saw earlier were on that table before, but people just dropped them off elsewhere. And we have another section here. And I believe we are at Arden Mall now. So from all of those hundreds and hundreds of soaps that I found a few days ago, only those are left. So those soaps were hot. And I believe now we are at Placerville. Yes, I believe we're at Placerville now. And I went here yesterday. 
um, I did participate in the 20% off $25 or more sale. And they actually, um, so they had some Valentine's and Easter wallflower plugs there. And this men's section actually got pretty depleted. It was full of body care and colognes. Uh, at least a week or two weeks ago when I was there. And now they're pretty much all gone. We had one graffiti cologne still hanging around. Old fashioned, um, oh, 50% off. So these candle holders, yes, they are 75% off. So we have three of the pineapples and one of the palm tree gold uh, candle holders. Placerville definitely had a lot of 75% off items in store. We had that strawberry pound cake box and the strawberry pound cake gift set there the, with the four items. I'm not a strawberry pound, pound cake fan, so I left those there. And these are the 50% off candles that they had left in store. And I actually thought these would all go 75% off during SAS. However, I'm guessing these will be at next SAS, winter SAS, for 75% off. So if you see any of these, most likely they will be discounted or clearanced out next SAS. And they have plenty of, um, a few soaps left. Bright Summer Days, uh, Strawberry Scoop in the gel soap, and Island Papaya. I don't think I've seen Island Papaya at all during SAS. Um, so I was kind of happy to see that. And we have some of the blend soaps left. That bin is pretty depleted. Usually when it's pretty depleted like that, there's a great chance that you'll get slimed. Rose Water and Ivy. That one's a little bit too rosy for me. And it's really fun to see all those soaps. I think I was spoiled by Arden Mall when I went shopping a few days ago. And here's another section of the 75% off at Placerville. Like I said, they had tons of products still left for that amazing discount. We have Blueberry Marshmallow Bar, Gingham Gorgeous, Dark uh, Oud, Sun Drenched Linen. So we have some single wicks and uh, blueberry marshmallow bar was the only three wick that they had for 75 percent off but i was happy to see that uh salt shack collection depleted beautiful day depleted looks like um people are shopping so it's definitely getting a little sparse pulse like cabana firecracker pop gingham love i really love that pulse like cabana and orange sparkling spritz those two are my favorite Fireside um, Sparkler, oh my gosh. Firecracker Pop is probably my third favorite on that table. Sunset Glow is definitely my least favorite. And it looks like some more bins are kind of um, emptying. We have Coco Paradise soap Bar Soap there. And yet another table full of body care. Now these bins are definitely a lot more full. And we have... Poppy, uh, Japanese Cherry Blossom, Sweet Whiskey, Gingham Love. Plenty still here. Um, if I believe they're going, they're going to start taking the summer sale away in a couple weeks, I believe they told me. I'm kind of forgetting. But yeah, there's still some chances to get some nice uh, discounts. Uh, we had the Sunset Glow and Plumeria in the Five Fragrance Mist for the Plumeria. And I was... Actually, I'm surprised that Golden Mango Lagoon, um, you're still able to find it because that's a really nice scent. I'm really enjoying that one. And I'm also enjoying Poolside Cabana in the shower gel. I just finished one about a week and a half ago. And yes, that's definitely one of my favorite shower gels that I've used as of late. And this is at Marketplace 99. Today, this was their, this is their 50% off candle offerings. And... I'm going to uh, show you that flower cart pretty soon, right over there. Yeah, we don't want that flower cart with that lid. No, 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 no. Because of that lid, that thing should be 75% off. And the other side here, um, yeah, Sweet Tea Lemonade. That's my favorite candle um, on this whole table, actually. Sweet Tea Lemonade, there were nine candles left. Firecracker Pop, plenty. And yes, there's still the Valentine candle. Uh, Valentine's Day candle, which I definitely am not fond of. It just smells a little sour to me, but that's just my nose. Looking over here, and we have some Mother's Day candles, which I thought was going to get clearanced out, but I guess I was wrong. 
two for twenty five single candles. This is today at Delta Shores Champagne Apple and Honey. Oh, I love this scent, and I love the kind of stained glass look to the label there. Leaves, uh, pumpkin pecan waffles. That one smells pretty strong. I love that. And sweater weather, caramel pumpkin swirl. I believe my favorite candle from this bunch would be Champagne Apple and Honey, and uh, Delta Shores had tons of single wick testers. I think these are always fun to look through because sometimes you'll find a candle that mm, was never really made into uh, a three wick or anything, or even a single wick. Just for the testers, we have Gingham Legend, Kitchen Lemon, and Honolulu Sun. I'm going to move the row forward to, to see the next row. Moonlight Path, White Gardenia, Antiki Beach, Palo Santo, Pineapple Mango. So, tons of single wick candles here. I don't always burn single wicks, but I, I do enjoy them sometimes. And yes, they are fun to look through. Market Peach, uh, White Tea and Sage, and Pineapple Mango. That one I thought was really cool to find. Cucumber Melon. And this was the other side, um, opposite side of the single wicks. They had a few three wick candles. Glacier Mist, Warm Ocean Breeze, uh cozy linen nectarine and one more i think the eucalyptus candle and here are some of the new single wicks cranberry orange seltzer the packaging reminds me of looking at land from up above kind of like we're about to descend onto a an orange planet uh salted butterscotch we have notes of let's see Pinch of sea salt, um, butter, I didn't get all of them, I apologize. Bourbon, maple, very dark, kind of looks like chocolate. And barrel-aged bourbon, sugared ambers, maple woods, cranberry orange seltzer. I prefer this lighting, so I wanted to take one more look at the packaging. And I put the cranberry orange seltzer on the water globe there. And I'm actually confused why those candle holders did not go to 75% off during SAS. That was a bit of a disappointment. And here are the 50% off candles, Merry Maple Bourbon. I'm guessing they weren't selling at 75% off, so they try, they're they trying to sell them at 50% off, maybe? I have no idea, but they definitely will not sell. White Tea and Ginger, Juniper Breeze. Wow, there's like tons of those. Um, is that not a good one? I For me, it's not really... A, a scent that I pick up. And that was my walkthrough from a couple days ago and today. I had fun shopping at Placerville. That's always a store I enjoy going to. And seeing all these single wicks at Delta Shores was also nice. I will see you in my next video. Bye!